DARPA funded research has come up with a technique to blow bubbles in space. Let's animate that. Since long, scientists have been trying to send large structures into space. However, sending these large structures into space is not feasible given the restrictions on the payload size. The patented invention from DARPA solves this problem with an ingenious solution by creating these large structures in space itself. It takes advantage of the very special conditions present in space, specifically microgravity which is the name given to the extremely low gravitational forces in space. One of the remarkable features of microgravity is the creation and sustenance of large bubbles in space. For example, it is possible to create bubbles which are 100 times bigger than bubbles possible under Earth's gravity. A 50 cm diameter bubble on Earth will be 50 meter in diameter when formed in space. To start with, injector ports are activated. Then a polymer film is placed over the injector ports. A gas is then injected through the injector ports onto the polymer film to inflate and form two bubbles. Which then intersect to form a flat surface in between. The polymer film also includes a UV curing agent which hardens when exposed to UV radiation for example UV radiation from the sun. After hardening the polymer bubbles one side of the intersection surface is coated with a metal in order to provide a reflective surface. Only the intersection surface of the bubbles are of use here Therefore, the remaining parts are separated. Such reflective surface may be as large as a kilometer in diameter. It can also be used as a solar sail for propulsion. The spaceship detaches from the mothership and is guided towards the solar sail cut out from the polymer bubbles. The spaceship then engages with the solar sail. Solar sails will make space travel far more cheaper and help us get further distances into the cosmos. Other applications of this technology include large aperture microwave reflectors and antennas on board satellites, calibration sources for ground and space based sensors, drag services for deorbiting spacecraft, and defensive mechanisms such as decoys to protect spacecraft from enemy. The producers of the movie Gravity can probably now think of a sequel. Let us know in the comments below what you will like to see in the sequel. Until next time, keep innovating and keep patenting. If you have solved a real life problem and want to patent for your invention, please feel free to reach out to us. Simply visit our website patentyogi.com and fill a form to send your invention details. We will get back to you with a free patent search. If you like to stay updated on future technology trends, do subscribe to our channel by clicking the big red button below. Once the aircraft climbs to a certain altitude, the turbojets are retracted into the fuselage. At this point, the rocket engine is ignited at full power, causing the aircraft to travel vertically like a rocket at supersonic speeds. A robotic arm is used to hold the drone and pull it out of the magazine. Thereafter, the drone is released. The 
opposite process is used to retrieve the drone.